Hey there, I'm Matt Clark. And I'm Jason Katzenbach. Today we're gonna to tell you about the biggest opportunity to build a real long-term $100,000 per month business that you've ever seen. This opportunity is likely the secret to the financial freedom you've been looking for. To start, we have a question for you. Have you ever bought anything on Amazon? Or do you know anyone who buys on Amazon? What if we told you there's a way you can build a real successful business of your own selling on Amazon? Today we're gonna to show you exactly how this works. We're also going to tell you why we've decided to come back and teach you this after a year and a half of focusing on our own successful businesses selling on Amazon. If you've heard about selling on Amazon before, nearly everything you know or think you know has all changed. You see, we've both sold millions of dollars worth of products on Amazon. In fact, the last year alone, we've built brand new, highly successful businesses from scratch, leveraging this massive online retailer. Last year in 2016, Amazon generated over $135 billion in sales. But what you may not realize is that Amazon is just getting started. There are two reasons for this. First, after all the widespread adoption of buying online after smartphones, tablets, and one-click ordering, pioneered by Amazon, by the way, online sales are still just a fraction of total sales. People are still buying lots of stuff in physical brick and mortar stores, but not for long. According to a report from the Department of Commerce, in 2016, e-commerce sales accounted for just 11.7% of total sales. This means only about one out of every 10 purchases was made online. Now let me ask you a question. Do you think in the future people will buy more online? We do. Online sales, as small as they are compared to total sales, are growing rapidly compared to brick and mortar sales. And who stands to win with this massive unstoppable trend? You guessed it, Amazon. According to a report by Slice Intelligence, Amazon accounted for 43% of all online sales in 2016. That's a 30% higher market share than the year before. This means Amazon is gobbling up a bigger and bigger share of online sales each year. Amazon's growth is even more dramatic internationally in Europe, Japan, and many other places. Now let's think about this for a second. Online sales are growing rapidly. Amazon's percentage of online sales is growing even faster. What does this mean? Well, if Amazon sold over 135 billion worth of products last year, it's completely realistic to believe that Amazon will be selling 300 to 400 billion per year in the next three to five years. And what does all of this mean for you? Well, you're about to find out. The second reason we know Amazon is just getting started is that they're not settling for just selling more the same old way. They're pushing the boundaries of what's possible and selling physical products like no company in history. With flying drone delivery around the world, local store pickup from online sales, massive completely automated warehouses all around the world, and even creating their own shipping company, it's absolutely mind-blowing what Amazon is going to achieve in just the next few years alone. So as I hope you're starting to understand, this is just the beginning for Amazon. We asked you just a few minutes ago if you or someone you know buys on Amazon. If you're like many hundreds of millions of people around the world, the answer is a resounding yes, or soon will be. What you may not know or completely understand right now is that it's not Amazon selling most of these products you buy on its website. It's people just like you and us. In about five minutes, you can have an account set up to sell products on Amazon's own website. We've taught a lot of people the business model that anybody can follow leveraging the power and massive reach of Amazon. We estimate the people we've taught are selling over $150 million per month on Amazon right now. Because of this success, we've been fortunate enough to meet incredible people such as Richard Branson, Robert Kiyosaki, and Russell Simmons. We've even been featured in Success Magazine, Forbes, Business.com, and more. We have members that have gone from knowing absolutely nothing about business or selling on Amazon to producing incredible life-changing businesses. For example, we have Peter and Adina. They're a couple from Romania that before starting this business barely spoke English. In fact, to learn how to do this business, they had to use Google Translate to even get started. They started with barely any money and now they own a business selling on Amazon in the US, a long way from where they live, that produced over $1 million in sales last year. And then we have Sarah Douglas from Redmond, Washington. 
Her and her husband started this business with zero experience while raising their young kids and working full time running two music schools. In just their second year of doing this business, they generated over a million dollars in sales and were able to quit teaching music altogether. Now in their third year, they're trending to do over three million dollars. In fact, they've already generated over a million dollars in just the past five months. We also have Theron Andrews from Sherman, Texas. Theron is a former marketing professional and musician who was laid off from his corporate job back in 2015 and was determined to never have to go back to his corporate world. He now runs a highly profitable Amazon business doing over 400,000 in sales a year and his products have become so profitable that Amazon has recruited him into their invitation only vendor program. These are people just like you and us that started with little to no experience and have gone on to completely change their lives forever with what you're about to learn. You can build a real, sustainable, highly profitable business starting today just like one of these people. There are just four primary steps you need to follow to do this. First, you need to select the right kind of product to sell. Second, you need to find a supplier for that product. Third, you need to use Amazon's shipping and warehouse service called Fulfillment by Amazon or FBA to automate the business so you never have to touch or manage any inventory. And fourth, you need to launch your product on Amazon and use a few special techniques to immediately get lots of sales so you start making money fast. Over the next few days, we're going to teach you each of these four steps. This video is just the first of a four-part series. By the end of watching each of these four videos, you will know the process for building this business the right way. You want to watch each in order so you don't miss anything. Today we're going to cover how to select the right kind of product to sell. If you follow the product selection process you're about to learn, you will have a great product that makes you profit each and every day, even while you sleep. There are millions of products sold on Amazon. With this process, you'll narrow that down into red-hot opportunities with high profit margins, low competition, and easy profit-producing potential. Before we get into today's lesson, let's talk briefly about where Jason and I come from so you know we know what we're talking about. Years ago, I was working an 80-hour-a-week job in investment banking, and I knew I had to get out. That job was draining me, and I wanted to be free to do whatever I want, whenever I want. I wanted to travel, spend time with my friends, spend time with my family, and truly live a free life with security and financial freedom. So I ventured out, left my high-paying job, and started my own business. I fumbled my way through building an e-commerce business selling physical products. It took years to figure everything out, but eventually I started seeing success. Things really took off when I discovered the opportunity on Amazon. I literally doubled my entire business I'd been building for years in about one week when I figured out how to make Amazon work for me. I scaled my Amazon sales to hundreds of thousands of dollars per month and millions of dollars per year, finally achieving true financial freedom. Along the way, I joined a high-level business networking group for people with seven-figure businesses and met Jason. In 1995, I started working for a large forest products company in Canada. And within a few years, I was getting promoted and transferred to other facilities. Things were going okay, but I had this constant nagging feeling inside that I was trapped. Then all of a sudden, the CEO of my company did away with all employee bonuses. Coincidentally, that same year, he received a seven plus million stock option bonus. I now was 100% convinced that my assumptions were true. I was not in control. My job was not secure, and all I was doing was working hard to make others wealthy. That was not freedom, and to me, being trapped was not acceptable. Within three years of having this newfound inspiration, I was able to create my own successful business, and more important, I was able to quit my job. That was in 2005, and for the next six years, I ran three different businesses that all were able to generate millions of dollars in revenue, but something was still missing. I never seemed to be able to truly gain control over what I was creating, and I knew I was missing something. That is when I decided to join that high-level masterminding networking group and met Matt. It was through that chance meeting that my eyes were opened to the power of creating my own brand and leveraging the insane power of Amazon. Within four months of getting my very first product up, I was generating hundreds of thousands of dollars in revenue each and every month with a very healthy 40% profit margin. I have not looked back since. We both are passionate about entrepreneurship and love helping people. Our mission is to give people freedom in their lives by teaching them how to build highly successful businesses. 
Far too many people in this world are slaves to job for years and years. Many never get to live their own lives. We don't want this to be you. We want to show you that there's another option, a way to build a successful business of your own quickly and for long term. We know you can do this. We've taught thousands of other people just like you that have come from all walks of life, all backgrounds and all over the world. And now it's your turn. The very first step is to get set up to sell on Amazon. Fortunately, this takes just about five minutes. The reason we've decided to release this video series is that the opportunity on Amazon right now is bigger than ever. One of the reasons for this is that Amazon has built huge platforms all around the world that you can sell on. We used to tell everyone to sell in the USA. Now, if you live in Europe, especially Germany or Japan, we actually recommend you sell on your local Amazon platform, such as Amazon.co.uk, Amazon.de, or Amazon.jp. There are billions of dollars in sales every year on these platforms, and the competition is crazy low. Now, if you do still live in the USA or in another non-European country and not in Japan, we recommend that you start with Amazon.com, the USA Amazon platform. So let's show you the right kind of account you need to quickly set up to sell on Amazon. So here I am over on Amazon Seller Central. As you can see, I, the URL is just sellercentral.amazon.com. And so this will be the page you'll actually log in from. Now, I went to Amazon.com. They have a page very similar for, as you can see here, is sellercentral.amazon.co.uk for the UK platform. Here is sellercentral.amazon.de. And here is sellercentral.amazon.co.jp. So you can use any one of these. Um, if you're in Japan, I would use the Japan one. If you are in Germany, I would use this one. If you're somewhere else in Europe, I would use the UK one. If you're anywhere else, you pretty much want to go to the .com, which is the USA platform. And so once you're over here, all you do is click this register now button and it'll take you to this page. So this is actually services.amazon.com. As you can see, they have a lot of information here. You're feel free to read through it if you want to, but basically what you need to do is you need to click this big start selling button. And there's a few different plans they'll mention. So if I go to this pricing uh, screen here, you can see that there are a couple different options. There's sales a professional, sales an individual. You don't really wanna mess with the sales as an individual. You're eventually gonna to have to change that anyways. So just great, go straight to selling as a professional because that's where all the features you need are going to be. So sell as a professional is just $39.99 a month, very inexpensive. So it's not like it costs very much, but this is the account you need to get set up to sell on Amazon. Once you've set up that account, you're ready to find your first product to sell. There are just five criteria you need to select a red hot product opportunity. The first criteria is selling price. You want to find products selling between $20 and $70. We found this to be the sweet spot when it comes to product price because there's enough profit margin in there for you to build a great business and inventory is not very expensive. Here's how to find the selling price of products on Amazon. So now I'm going to show you how to find the product selling price for the products you're researching on Amazon. And sometimes Amazon changes how the listing setup looks based on the category. So in this first example, you can see once the page loads right front and center, you see the price. So what there is, is there's the price. And this is what usually in the back end they put is like the manufactured recommended price. So this is just a higher price they'll put in to make it look like they're selling it at a much lower price. The sale price here is what it's currently being sold at. And you'll find most times you will see that there will always be a sale price put in on Amazon. Most people do that. So they'll have it so that they're saying the product goes for $99, but they're selling selling it for 43, but in this example, I imagine they're probably constantly selling it at around the $43 mark. Another example here, you can see how now the product price is over on the side, but again, the same thing. You see list price, $24.99, but the actual price they're selling it for is $22.05. So one thing to keep in mind as well when you're looking at price, that for both of these examples you'll see this one says $43.99 and free shipping and this one says $22 and free shipping in orders over $35. That's because Amazon offers free shipping on products over $35. So that's another important incentive to keep in mind when you're looking at what to price your product on. The second criteria is what's called best sellers rank. For Red Hot Opportunities, you want a bestseller's rank between 500 and 5,000. One of the most amazing parts about selling on Amazon is that it tells you exactly which products are most popular. 
products with the lowest best sellers rank are the products that are selling the best. Think of this just like a competition. The number one product is the top product. However, because Amazon is so huge, you don't need and don't want to sell products that are ranked at the top. Those products are usually just too competitive. There are incredible opportunities if you go just a little deeper that produce thousands of dollars in profit per month each. You see, Amazon has more than doubled in size since we started selling on this huge platform. This means that now there are actually even more great product opportunities available for you to choose from. So here's how to find the best seller's rank. So once you're over on Amazon, to start finding products within a certain best seller's rank range, a little trick is to type in the open bracket here, close bracket here, and start selecting a category. Now in one of the PDFs you get access to as part of this launch video, you'll learn categories that are good and categories to avoid. But for this example, I'm just gonna pick the baby category and I put that little search operator in there and click the search button. And as you can see, it pulls up a whole bunch of products that are more or less sorted by best sellers rank. And so if I start looking at some of these, like say for example, this one, I open this, uh, I guess, oil diffuser up and I scroll down, you can see this is one of the products sold on Amazon. If I scroll down to this section that says product information, so as you can see it says best sellers rank is number four in home and kitchen. So this product is ranked number four, the fourth best selling product in all of home and kitchen. So I'm gonna close that one and I'm gonna show you another example. So I can keep going down. There's gonna be a lot of pages here I can flip through. So there's 400 pages. So let me just jump over to page three to show you something. So. If I keep scrolling down here and I say, for example, so there's another similar product, so essential oil diffuser. If I click on this one, so now this is on the third page, and I scroll down here to the product details on some product pages, for whatever reason on Amazon, it's slightly different, but same kind of section. And this one says Amazon best sellers rank. So this one is number 346 in health and personal care. So remember, you're looking for products that are between 500 and 5,000 and this what we call the top level category. So this is the one that's right here, 346 in health and personal care. These subcategories, you don't really need to worry about those pretty much at all. So as you can see, this is number one. You could be like, oh, this is the number one best selling product in the category. Yeah, but it's the sub, 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 sub category of chemicals all the way deep into all the rest of these categories. So this could be number one in this category, but it could be number 50,000 in the top level category and barely ever sell anything. And so really just pay attention to this top level category. And the way to do it is you type in this little search operator here, choose a category and start digging through these deeper and deeper. So I could go to page four, I could go to page five, I could go to page 100, 200, however deep I need to go until I start finding products that are between 500 and 5,000. And so I'm gonna show you a couple other examples just so you're super clear on the top level category versus the subcategory ranking. And so this is just another random product I kind of have pulled up here. So if I scroll down to this product details section, this is 128 in health and personal care. So that's the top level category, but it's number two in, you know, medical supplies and equipment, health monitors, body weight scales, digital. So don't really worry about that one, just 128. That's all you're worried about. So if I jump over to this different product, which looks like a luggage scale. So if I scroll down for this one, this is number two in industrial scientific, so super high ranked, and it's number one in these other ones. So really only worry about the top one. In this case, it's industrial and scientific. And then one last example, just to make this even more clear, is this is a temperature calibrator, apparently. And so this one is number 18,000 in the top level category, which is industrial and scientific. So this product would not fit that 500 to 5,000 range. Uh, but it is, you could get confused and think that, oh, this is number 15 or number 232, but these are subcategories, not what you wanna worry about. So just focus on the top level category. The third criteria of the red hot product opportunity is weight. You want a product that's small and as light as possible. This makes the shipping process easier, cheaper, and faster. We recommend selling products that are no more than three pounds in weight. We also recommend finding products that are smaller if possible. Here's an example of what this looks like. So what I have in front of you here are three product opportunities that I want to show you about the weight and size of the product. So when you go to these opportunities, you want to scroll down until you see the product details section. In the product details or product information section, you'll see the product dimensions and item weight. As we mentioned, you wanna find products that are less than three pounds and preferably smaller. 
As you can see for this product, which is selling quite well, this product weighs 2.8 pounds, so it's just under the three pound mark. Because of the larger product dimensions, you have to consider how many packages can be put into a shipping container and sent over. The smaller the product dimensions, the more you can send, therefore lowering your price. And the lower the weight, because you do pay shipping based on weight as well, the cheaper you'll get the product. So this is a decent product, 2.8 pounds, but it does have a larger packaging size. This doesn't mean this isn't a good product. In fact, this is a great opportunity. It has a decent selling BSR. It has a good selling price. It's upwards of $43. And because of this in combination, we're estimating that this product's probably earning about $33,000 each and every month in revenue. Another example we have here are these disposable plastic plates. This is a great product, easy to private label, and if we come down here, the problem is it's very heavy and the packaging is very large. So you're gonna be spending a lot of money to get this inventory to Amazon. So this doesn't mean that these aren't good products to eventually get into, but for just starting out, you wanna be very smart with your cash flow. So you want to avoid products like this so you can send the majority of your cash flow on paying for the actual inventory rather than wasting it on shipping expenses. One other example I have for you, which this is another great product, selling at a high price of $49, and it's selling quite well. It has a BSR of 2,779, and so because of that, you know, we're estimating that this product's doing easily another $30,000 a month in revenue. It's got a decent weight, 2.2 pounds, as you can sell, tell by shipping weight, and the product they mentions, it's fairly large still, which makes it a little riskier, but because of the weight, you can see here that it does meet our criteria. Now, one thing important to notice, you'll notice that sometimes Amazon changes how the product area looks. So you've got the product information on this one, how it has the gray area, but on this one, you can see it looks a little different. So what you're looking for is either product details, or product information. It just depends on whatever the category is. Amazon sometimes gives you different titles for that area. The fourth criteria of the Red Hot product opportunity is the number of reviews. When an Amazon customer is shopping around and deciding which product to buy, a big factor is the number of reviews of one product versus another. The number of reviews is an indicator of social proof. The more reviews, the better the customer thinks the product is. So, you want to look for product opportunities with less than 500 reviews. This means it's still easy for you to come in with a new product starting with no reviews and still be a compelling option for the potential buyers. Here's what this looks like on Amazon. Now I want to show you a couple of good examples of products with less than 500 reviews. And finding the reviews is really easy, as when you first go to the product, you'll see right under the title the amount of reviews that there are. So you'll notice with this one, this looks like it's a magnetic spice tin selling at a good price, $33.75. And if we scroll down to look at the top level BSR, we see that it's 2,291. So we know this product's selling probably about 30 units a day, but with only 138 custom reviews, you could easily come in here and start competing with this product. Another example of this is this organic pack and play mini crib sheet set. So it's selling for $23.99 and it only has 44 customer reviews, but yet if we scroll down, we'll see that it has a BSR of 2,596. So again, selling probably around 30 units a day, making a very good monthly revenue. So these are two products with decent amount of reviews for you to be able to come in and compete with. The last criteria of a red hot product opportunity is what we call private label potential. Years ago when I built my first business, I was selling high-end supplements with other companies branding on them. It was a pretty good business and I was able to scale it up to about $2 million a year in revenue in about two years. However, I kept seeing new marketing opportunities, including selling the products on Amazon. But the brands were still stuck in the old days of selling these products directly to doctor's offices. I dreaded opening my email at the time because I knew I would have yet another manufacturer with an angry email telling me where I could or could not sell their brand. Luckily, I eventually discovered that I could actually sell similar products with my own branding on them. It was basically the same product, I just used a manufacturer that would put my own made up brand name on the product labeling. 
My profit margins went way up. I now had the freedom to control what I did with the brand. To build a real, long-term, highly profitable business, you absolutely must sell your own products. You don't want to be at the mercy of whatever a brand wants you to do. Fortunately, it's incredibly simple to create your own brand these days. You can do this with just about any product on Amazon. Let's take a look at a few examples. So now I want to show you just a couple examples of more products that are great opportunities and how they can be easily private labeled. So I hope you're seeing with all the examples we've been showing you that all of these products can be easily private labeled, but we want to show you a couple more examples. So the first one I have here is the Aquatopia Deluxe Safety Easy Bath Kneeler. And as you see the product, if we look at different examples, it just simply has the name Aquatopia on here. So really the branding itself on the product, your private labeler will easily do that. You can look at how this person's product is, make it your own unique way, come up with your own unique brand name. And for the packaging, it's very simple. Most likely the manufacturer itself will give you some packaging options. You could even just put it in a simple bag or you could get fancier and get them to put it in a box and the manufacturers are very easy to work with they usually work directly with packaging suppliers if they don't have one in-house already so you just work with them you can either work with their in-house designers if they have that available or you could use some services like 99designs and be able to figure out what your branding needs to look like to work with them. We recommend starting easier. Usually just start with the branding options that come with the, the branding and packaging options that come from the manufacturers themselves. But as you can see, you could easily brand this and do some creative packaging. And here's another product example that you can easily get your own private labeling branding on. This is a bathroom surface cleaner. It doesn't come with the drill as you can see, but you can come up with your own brand name, do your own distinct coloring, and really package it however you want. It doesn't look like there's any branding on the actual products themselves, but they have this great name, the drill brush, power scrubber, you can come up with your own name. And packaging, again, can be really simple. Again, you just use the manufacturer, it can come in just a poly bag if you want initially. As you start getting sales coming in, you can start working with the manufacturers and to be able to really create your own unique branding. Now, one thing I did notice, if you look at this picture and you can see that they actually have a little bit of branding right there. So even just putting the branding on the product itself itself is super easy. Just in this little area, they have the name of their website right there, and it probably says drillbrush.com. Hard to see from here, but it's just so easy to be able to get this stuff uniquely branded to whatever brand name you want, and then do simple packaging to get started with, to get your product up on Amazon. And again, once it starts selling, once you start getting the cash flow come in, you get more complicated with the packaging and really design it to meet the niche that you're in, the market that you're in. So if this one, if it's primarily primarily females that are buying this product. You would find that out through all your customer database that you'd be gathering, that you can really start refining this to really hone in on what that market would want from a packaging standpoint. So how much can one of these product opportunities actually make you? With over $135 billion a year in revenue, there's a crazy amount of sales on Amazon every single day. Some products sell over $50,000 per day on Amazon alone. That's obviously a little extreme, but we just want to let you know the magnitude of the sales potential here. An average product we, or one of the people we've taught sell on Amazon, can produce anywhere from fifteen dollars to $40,000 per month in sales. A typical profit margin, meaning money in your pocket per sale, is around 30 to 40%. This means a single product can make you between $4,500 to $16,000 per month in pure profit. Amazon doesn't release exact sales data for products sold on its platform, so we have to extrapolate the sales data based on our own results selling on Amazon and the results of other top Amazon sellers we know. Just to give you an idea, here's a few estimations of the sales and profit levels of products sold on Amazon. So here I am over on Amazon just looking at a couple different product examples to show you exactly how much these different opportunities can make. So this is an outdoor wireless security camera, it sells for about $70. If I scroll down to the uh, product information section, best sellers rank on Amazon is number 755 in home and kitchen. We estimate this product uh, sells about 3,000 a month or about 100 a day, number of units. And that's about $218,000 a month in sales or at around a 30% profit margin, about $65,000 a month in profit.
from this one single product. And as another example, this is a, one of the essential oil diffusers. If I scroll down, and this product sells for about $27. And if I scroll down, this product is ranked about 744 in home and kitchen. And so this product we estimate sells also around 3,000 units a month or about 100 a day. Uh, estimated monthly sales is about $83,000. And once again, at about 30% profit margin, after everything's considered, that's about $25,000 a month in profit from this one single product on Amazon. That's not even in the top 100, not even in the top 500 of its category on this massive platform. And remember, nearly all of that happens 24 hours a day, seven days a week, whether you're on vacation or spending time with your family. Sales on Amazon keep rolling in no matter what you do with your time. And that's just one product. In this series, you're gonna learn about how to multiply this level of sales rapidly. This is how we've sold hundreds of thousands of dollars on Amazon in a single month. And so have people we've taught. For example, Devin DeRoche, one of the people we've taught who just started this business a couple years ago, sold over $400,000 in December of last year alone. One of the best parts of this business is that you can do it from anywhere. No matter where you live, you can do this business. We have members from over 100 different countries that sell in the USA and on Amazon platforms around the world. By leveraging Amazon's vast resources, you can automate all of the shipping, order processing, and even most of the customer service. You can run this business from a coffee shop in Paris or a beach in Thailand. It's up to you what you do with your freedom. This is how Peter and Adina built a million dollar business selling in the USA all the way from Romania without ever stepping foot in America. With what you've just learned, you've dramatically increased the level of success you can achieve selling on Amazon. Oh, we're just getting started. You know the saying about teaching someone to fish rather than just giving them the fish? Well, you just learned how to fish. You now know the process for finding a near endless number of amazing product opportunities on Amazon. But we want to go one step further. We're actually just going to give you some fish. Over the past month, we followed the process you just learned and put together a big database of red hot product opportunities. Each one of these is an opportunity to produce thousands of dollars each and every single month in profit. And we're just giving them all to you. Enter your email below this video as soon as you finish watching it and you'll get instant access to 100 incredible product opportunities on Amazon. Plus, we're giving you a list of good product categories to find red hot product opportunities and categories to absolutely avoid on Amazon. Not only that, we've also included a brief guide to help you get set up to sell on Amazon from whatever country you live in. This is our gift to you to get you started on this incredible journey. Remember, there are four videos in this series. In the next video, which releases on Friday, April 14th, you're gonna learn the new process for finding suppliers for any product you wanna sell and how you can get the best margins available so you maximize your profit from every sale you make on Amazon. You'll also learn the exact process to automate this business leveraging Amazon so you free your time up to do whatever you want. Go ahead and enter your email below this video to grab your copy of the 100 red hot product opportunities while they're still available. We're gonna have to remove them soon, so grab them while you can. There's one more thing. One of our very successful members with zero Amazon experience before has built an entire multi-million dollar company sourcing products from China without ever stepping foot in that country. In the next video of this series, you'll learn how he does it and you'll even get to see his real live results inside his own Amazon seller account. See you in the next video.